Alright guys, what's up? I am back, and I'm going to start a little something new, but before I get to that, I just want to talk about a few football games that occurred this weekend, one of them obviously happening yesterday, between uh, USC and Ohio State, and as I predicted, and as I think a lot of people thought was going to happen, USC pretty much blew out Ohio State. I don't think it had a lot to do with the fact that Ohio State didn't have Beanie Wells. They just weren't fast enough. The pressure was getting on uh, the Ohio State quarterbacks, no matter which one it was, too quick. And I think just talent-wise, I think USC is pretty much in a league of its own. I think a few people, or, uh, excuse me, I think a few teams could really take on USC. You know, I think a Florida, the Florida team could definitely take on uh, USC, and I definitely think Oklahoma as well has enough talent to take on USC. But this year, I don't think Ohio State had the talent whatsoever to be even really up in that same upper echelon of elite teams in college football. Now moving on to a game that happened today between the Denver Broncos and the San Diego Chargers. Now I'm assuming most of you probably didn't see the game. You probably saw the uh, Patriots-Jets games instead, but since we're out on the uh, West Coast, we saw the Chargers-Broncos game. It was an extremely good game, especially if you like offense because defense was pretty much not there at all. There was a lot of questionable calls, and I will definitely say that in the end, Jay Cutler did fumble that ball. I have no problem saying it, and basically the Broncos stole one which is good for me, but if you're a Charger fan, that probably sucks, but good thing I'm not a Charger fan, I guess. And moving on finally to what the main point of this video, I guess, is about, and it's something I'm going to start doing every week, and it'll be like a little Monday night prediction things, but I'll either get them out, you know, early Monday, or probably most likely Sunday, and I'll basically just break down and give you my prediction of the Monday night game. And this week, the Monday night game is between the Philadelphia Eagles and the Dallas Cowboys. Now, what do I see happening in this game? Honestly, I think these two teams will be battling it out all year for that uh, NFC East title. I think these are the two best teams in the NFC East this year. Uh, I think it's going to be a rebound year for the Eagles. I think they will make the playoff either way. Excuse me, I think they will make the playoffs either way. And both of these teams, obviously a lot of people have the Cowboys going all the way. So I think tomorrow's game is going to be very good. You know, my heart is honestly telling me to go with the Eagles. My mind is telling me to go with the Cowboys. So honestly, I don't know which way to go on this, you know. I think it, there's a lot to do with uh, how the Cowboys' offense does. You know, if they're hitting on all cylinders, I don't think anybody can beat them. But we'll see if the Eagles' defense could slow them down. But I guess I will go with my heart and go with the minor upset. And I will say that the Eagles will pull up a pretty big upset, actually, over the Dallas Cowboys, a lot of people's favorite to win the entire Super Bowl, but we'll see what happens there. I expect it to be a decently high-scoring game. I bet it finishes, you know, the winner will probably finish in the 30s. I expect the loser to be in the high 20s. It will be a good game, and it'll be worth watching. So, let's just hope it's a great game, and that's it for now.